Hi, I finished another from um, my recent charity book hauls and it's His and Hers by Mike Gale. Oh, a pet hate of mine. Don't you hate these easy to peel stickers that never come off? Oh, it's a real thing about mine. I hate it. Anyway, I hate the stickers, but not the book. Uh, this is the third Mike Gale book that I've got and he's turning into the author that I go to when I want nice, easy characters and nice situations and observations because I think he is brilliant um, at observing the the little details and, and bringing them to life. Um, we've got two characters, Jim and Alison, and we meet them in 2003 when a chance encounter brings them together for the first time in four years. And then we go back to 1989 to their first meeting in the student union of Birmingham University. And the book charts their relationship through their own individual perspectives from 1989 to, to 2003. And for me, I, I went to uni at Birmingham. I was at Birmingham University. So this, I could relate to, to this because I could recognise bits of, you know, where I could recognise places, you know, when they're, you know, Selly Oak and, and things like that, you know, if all the places meant something to me. Um, but more than that, through the um, relationship, and it's take it's told in alternate perspectives. You know, Alison's chapter, uh, Alison's part, Jim's part. The details, the observational details, are super. You know, he he brings to life boring, mundane events. He makes them relatable because he describes them because it, we all do the mundane things. But he writes it in such a way that the mundane is interesting, if you see what I mean. And through their alternate sections, we see their relationship, we see their first dates, meeting the parents, um, moving in together, splitting up. And yeah, I mean, I really enjoyed it because it, it's written in such a way that you can recognise events, you can recognise situations. And Jim and Alison are both likeable people. Um, romance, humour. And, a, you know, and it says here, a cat, a flat and a couple who think it's over. It's got a cat in it as well. So, why, you know, humour, romance, cat. It ticked all my boxes. So, um, His and Hers by Mike Gale. Um, I'm, I'm slowly working my way through his books. Um, I pick them up every now and again when I want a, uh, a palate cleanser type thing. So, um, I think I've got another one on my bookshelf. I can't remember what it's called. But I'll have a, a look and, you know, I'll get around to that at some point. I've got a whole load of other stuff on my TBR at the moment. So, um, His and Hers by Mike Gale. I enjoyed it. So, happy reading. Take care.